Hello, guys. I'm not in Maui and I'm so sad. I'm in my other usual place, which is Costco. And I'm a little exposed because I got parking right up in front of the building right here. And there's a walkway that goes over to the corporate offices. So all the employees walk past here and they're going to see my camera. And I can't really cover it up because then I won't have any light <laughs> coming in the window. So we're going to do a quick update. We are back at home. It's been a couple days. Um, my sunburn is peeling. Um, my tattoo is healing. If you have not seen that video, I actually haven't edited it yet, but um, I got a tattoo the last night that we were in Hawaii and it is healing. I will show it to you later on tonight. I'm going to take the wrap off of it. Today is day four of having that wrap covered and they said to keep it on for three to five days, but it's kind of bugging me and I People are like, we have a friend, Jason's having a guy's night tomorrow night and he really wants to see it, I'm sure. And so I don't want it all gross and <laughs> covered up and I want to clean it and put some moisture on it. I've got some lotion that I got at the store for it. Um, so all of that is good and we're back and the kids are still doing their regular routine with school and we gave them all their little souvenirs, which they liked. And, um, and I got employees, their souvenirs. Um, Jason's having fun. Well, he's not having fun. <laughs> he's enjoying going back to work, uh, getting things caught up. His employee is off on a month long cruise journey. She's doing two or three different cruises. So he's kind of having to be, be extra working. Um, he's having to extra, he's having to work extra, um, for the next month or so. So he will not be home with me on Fridays, which is kind of a bummer, but he is home on Mondays. And let's see, Kaylee, we just, as you kind of saw just now, um, went to her orthopedic specialist to follow up on her knee. She had her knee dislocated at a high school game. In case you have not watched that video, you can go and check that one out. So we were doing a follow, follow up today on the new brace that she has been using on pain management um, and her range of motion. I can't do it with my, my hand, but whether her, her knee can bend and how far it can bend. And the doctor's not pleased with how little it can fully extend out. And so we have to play a game with insurance, which is so stupid. And I just was talking to my dad and it drives him crazy. He's a doctor. And so this kind of stuff irks him so bad. Um, so we have to play a game with insurance. So we have to schedule PT and start that process and put the order in for an MRI. And at the same time, and hope that insurance, based off the doctor's approval for the MRI, that they will just accept that we need to get an MRI. But if not, then we have this, oh, well, we are signing up for PT, so go ahead and approve the MRI. Um, but in talking to my dad, he's like, you need to advocate for this. He's like, we don't have 10 to 14 days to wait for her to get that MRI. If she, why is that big, huge truck coming through the Costco parking lot? Um, that's, <laughs> I don't know where you think you're going to park that thing. Oh, they just crushed that curb. Um, yeah, that's not where you, you don't come to Costco when you drive that. So that's weird. Anyway, and I can't get this up high enough so you don't see my steering wheel. But if I go home, I need to go and work out. So I'm trying to get this done while I'm here. Um, what was I going to say? Anyway, my dad was like, you need to advocate. You know, you need to call next week. Um, and have them bug the insurance because if we don't find out quickly um, if there's a tear in her meniscus, if there's a tear in the ligament, if there's a tear or damage to the cartilage, which is what the doctor is actually worried about, and that's why the leg won't fully extend, um, we need to get surgery done and or else that will be irreparable. It will be permanent damage to her knee and it will never fully straighten or fully bend. And he's like, so you've got to advocate, which is what my favorite thing to do is. So <laughs> that's what I have to go home to do is um, call and schedule the PT. Luckily, we already know a PT place because of Abby. And we will go ahead and keep bugging them to bug the insurance company for MRI. Um, what else is going on? Abby is approved for her braces, which we found out the last day we were in Hawaii, which is fantastic. She was very excited about that. She starts that process next week and she's very excited. Uh, Chelsea is doing good with school, but she's now realizing it's hard to have 
all the subjects every single day. <laughs> she's in seventh grade and she's just realizing this is my life for the next seven years. And I was like, yeah, this is. And Ashley was bummed she did not have cheer practice two nights ago and was really bothered by that. And so she's very excited for cheer practice tonight and hoping that the boys on the football team go to championship games so that she can keep cheering into November. She loves cheerleading and I don't know what I'm gonna do without it. Um, we're gonna have a lot of play dates with those friends of hers that she's made, but also I think I might put her into gymnastics or something to get her toned and ready for gymnast or ready for cheer next year so she can do maybe more tumbling and things like that in the meantime and getting her kind of stretched out. Otherwise, we're all doing great. I'm here at Costco for the second time this week. I did a full stock up to get the kids all fed and ready to go for the week two days ago. And I have already forgotten breakfast drinks and I'm gonna get a gift for Jason. It is his birthday in three days. I need to not forget that. Even though he did just get a trip to Hawaii. Um, but I, there's one more thing that I can't remember I didn't get at Costco and it was like not a thing like, like pirate's booty, like I don't need that, so I'm not gonna go back for it, but there was one other thing that I'm like, oh, we actually need that. Now I can't remember what it is. So I'm gonna go walk to Costco for just a second, find a birthday present and breakfast drinks and remember what the other thing is. So thank you for letting me little rant on this little update with everyone, and I will show you my tattoo when we get home, and then I'll show you what it looks like with everything removed and give you an update on that. Okay, someone is legit having their car delivered here. Go to the dealership that we have the room to do this. I can't believe someone's having their car delivered here. This isn't where you do it. I had this car delivered not by Ford. It was delivered by an independent um, shipping company from my friend who owns the dealership. And he was like, you live right by a Ford dealership. It's like 10, 15 minutes away from you. Can I just meet you there? Cause like they already are used to having car deliveries and it's, they're set up for it. They have the space for it. Can I just meet you there? And I was like, yeah, but like, why would you have this delivered at Costco? Like this is like taking out space. It's in the way. It's not cool, dude. Not cool. Okay. Luckily this video will go up after his birthday. So we are going to go ahead and show you what he is going to get. Do you miss me being back here at my desk? <laughs> Tonight, so I've been working on a few things here at my desk that I just couldn't walk and do at the same time. I kind of had to like straighten things up. And uh, I'm working on, did you even see that on my screen? I'm working on the surprise video, you guys. And I could not, before we left, get it to export out of iMovie. I'm, I'm not gonna go into the technical details, but I just couldn't get it to get the file in order to upload it to YouTube. I've been working on it now for the past hour, tried to run all my updates for my software on my computer. That didn't work. I've been YouTubing, okay, what fix, and this fix, and this fix, and nothing was working. I think I just found it. And I will let you know, I'm trying to cancel out of one of the attempts that I was making to export, because I know now where the error was. And I think I took out, there was like a little like half a second glitch in the video. And I don't know why, it just was a glitch in, the, in that one little clip. And I took it out and so now I think it's gonna work, which means you'll get to see it tomorrow. I don't know what date that's gonna be yet because I'm still editing Maui videos. But this has been driving me crazy because I want you guys to see our last surprise. And it's all filmed, it's all done. The surprise has already happened. Like everything is all done and I wanna share it with you but I literally can't share it with you because it won't get me the file. So, fingers crossed. And let me show you my, while we wait for that, I'm just waiting for that before I can move on. Let me show you my tattoo really quick. All right, so it looks, I don't know. I don't like the way it looks with it all covered up and there's like, oh, I won't be too graphic, but there's, there's um, certain dried things all over the tattoo. So I need to get it cleaned up and improve the color and stuff. But I'm going to take this wrap off tonight and get it all cleaned, but I do love it. It's it's kind of big. <laughs> I'm a little intimidated by how big it is now, 
Can't believe I did one this big for my first one. Um, also, my cute nails. I had my nail break off the, the day before we came home. So I went and got these done yesterday. But um, maybe it's kind of homage to the color of my tattoo. I didn't realize. Guess what? It's been hours since I picked up this camera. But I got our surprise video to work. There was a teeny tiny glitch in it. And I found it. And I got it to work. Sorry, bad light. But now I've got to get Ashley ready for cheer in the next 10 minutes or so. She actually gets to go to cheer today. I was worried they were gonna cancel again because her coaches have been sick, but she gets to go. Let me put you down here for a second. You can join me in the cupboard. I had to go back to Costco. Oh, you saw me. I went and got breakfast drinks and Jason's present. I actually already wrapped it up for him. And I literally put it right underneath his desk and I guarantee you, he's not gonna notice. He's not gonna notice at all. <laughs> he's kind of a funny man. Maybe he will. Um, he actually ordered some stuff himself that he kind of said, eh, I count this as part of my birthday present to myself because he just wanted to have some stuff that was very specific and uh, I didn't want to have to research it myself. So I told him to go ahead and do it. So. Um, and maybe he can show you that stuff on his birthday. There's Ashley. Should we say hi to Ashley? There's Ashley, boo. Mm -hmm. You want to get ready for chair? It is black today. Yeah, black shirt. Okay. Um, can you put these in Kaylee's bucket? That's what she wore today. Uh, and then get dressed. Is this someone's, is that, an, oh, it's a peach. Someone didn't finish their peach today. Put that in the fridge for me. Do you want me to bring these goldfish as a little snack while you're at cheer? No? Okay. Okay, she's getting ready for cheer. We're going to head out. She gets to wear her jacket today because it's a little chilly. And we're outside. You're outside? I thought it was inside in the comments. Is it the same one that... No, it's pictures? not the same one. It's a different one. Regardless of whether it's inside or out, it's cold right now to go outside to the car. Yep. Yeah, but you should be practicing inside. The whole idea We're is. Gonna be doing this stunting, so it'll be annoying to have. Yeah. All right. Fast forward to 9:30 p.m., and I have everyone and myself excitedly wanting me to take off my tattoo little shield or whatever it's called, and, oh, and I got the wrong kind. I had remembered seeing Aquaphor on the list. But it's actually do not put Vaseline, Neosporin, Polysporin, Aquaphor, or A and D onto the tattoo. So I had it in my head. I saw it on the list, just on the wrong list. So Jason is nice enough right now. He's going to go and get me some Curel or some Eucerin. And I thought for sure we even had those, but we don't. So he's going to run down and target for me because I really want to take it off and everyone else wants to see it tonight. And if I wait till tomorrow, which I don't mind doing, but I'm not waiting for everyone else to get home. <laughs> so I'll do it without everyone else watching it. So he's going to go do that for me. But hopefully you don't mind. I'm going to take this makeup off my face. Because I'm over having it on. I'm going to finish watching Bachelor in Paradise while they go to Target for me. And then we'll take this tattoo cover off. And I'll go to bed. So thank you to my husband for doing this for me. Jason chose this t-shirt to put on appropriately skin factor tattoo and he got me my lotion so now I can wash it you ready like you want to go and ask Kaylee she wants to come down she wanted to watch me peel it off yeah okay let's do this thing okay so ew, this is so weird it doesn't hurt I don't think to take it off it's just weird she's been on Oh, it feels so strange. Does it hurt? It's a little stiff. It's like a band-aid. The color. Yeah, the I feel color like some of the color down. came off. Huh. Alright. There it is. And the little black so spot. Yes. Yeah, that's that'll probably wash Yeah, off. that'll wash yeah, out. This is all gonna wash off. So then I just wash it with warm water. 
Ah, it feels good. That's blood right there. The wasting water. Well, I'm not gonna get any help either. All right, well. Cleans up nice. Cleans up kind of nice. It was nice to have back. that. Yeah, that center color came back. It was covered the in detail. blood. detail, yeah. Just need to make sure I wipe it all. See, this is like, there's like dried on blood. Yeah. It'll come off. Okay, let's rinse it and then maybe do it one more time. Okay. Get the soap out. I'll get it. Okay. Yeah, let's stop. Ow. Okay, right, so we we've washed twice. Day. We wash it twice, and then you pat yeah. it dry. Then you let it air for five minutes. Actually, it's my our little instruction giver. What are we doing next? Five minutes. We let it air out. Air out for five minutes. The inside is like sparkly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know if I can't. I can't tell if that's like more blood in there. Maybe I should wash that again. It look it looks too real. I kind of feel like there's some more like like dry in there. Shiny. What are we doing now? Air, let it air out. For five minutes. Well, we washed it one more time. I think I got a little bit more dried blood out of the center. It's, probably it's really glary right now just because of the light, but we're going to um, dry it off. I'm going to go sit down on the couch and let it air out. Pretty cool, huh? It's pretty fun. All right, it has aired out, and I have my lotion. It's still really sensitive. So I'm just gonna work this lotion in, and I guess it's done. All right, it's the next day. This one is staying home from school for a little while. We're gonna see how it goes. She's just working on a few things for school, right? Mm -hmm. And got caught up on sleep. I was a little tired this morning. But she wants to see my tattoo. She was in bed last night when we did this. I was so tired. Yeah. I so was so sleeping fourth period. Here it is this morning. Will you hold the camera real quick? Sure. And uh, I'm just going to put a little lotion on it before I work out this morning. Here. Should I carry it? It's still really sensitive. Like... Mm -hmm. Like resting my legs on top of each other last night was not comfortable. Well, I mean, still. it still hurts because like the needle. The right, needle like used. in and out, yeah. So, it's all ready to heal. Here. Okay, so I got tired last night after I did that little treatment and whatnot. I watched the show and then I went to bed. And I didn't sleep very well. Again, I don't know what's wrong. Jason didn't sleep well either. And um, so I slept in, Chelsea took Ashley to the bus, <laughs> and uh, which I hardly ever do, um, but Ashley was fine with that. Um, next year she probably will go to the bus stop, bus stop by herself, but I just took uh, a lazy morning this morning. Lazy as in like I got up at nine. But I have my little routine here with my tattoo, and I'm going to edit this video. So I'm going to say good goodbye to you. I, it's not good night, it's good morning. I'm going to hop on the treadmill this morning and edit and work out and do all the things. So thank you for joining us on our days back from Maui. <laughs> I hate being back from Hawaii. In fact, I just saw a deal yesterday that someone's trying to fill their um, condo rental in two weeks <laughs> and it was such a good deal it was like a five day stay it was seriously like so so cheap because they were just desperate to fill it because they had a last minute cancellation and I was like yeah I can't even ask right Chels <laughs> it's like two weeks away always I'm always I could just take you I could I could take one of my children one of these times only me only you yeah all right say goodbye Bye -bye. You didn't say hi to them. Yeah. But she's doing pretty good. All right. Take care, you guys. Of all the magic places in the world I've been to, this is where my heart is. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you.